Don't go into it expecting any like crazy flavors. You touch on the cookies. That's really good. Hi guys, I'm Aria, I'm here with Jack, and welcome to this week's Crumble Cookies review video. We have five delicious flavors here to try. They all look amazing. Jack, how many are you gonna taste with me today? I'm thinking zero, but he's here for moral support. One? Okay, well that's better than zero. Let's see. All right guys, here is a close up of this week's Crumble Cookies. They look so good. We've got frozen hot chocolate. We have eggnog. We have birthday cake holiday. We have snickerdoodle. And we have red velvet white chip. They all look amazing. Yes, I did get two of the birthday cake holiday because I love the birthday cake flavor, so I wanted more of those. I like the blueberry one. Crumble, if you're watching, Jack is requesting for the blueberry cookie to come back. Okay, Jack, which cookie should we try first? Okay, Jack would like to try... Let me touch on the cookies. Okay, Jack wants to try the birthday cake holiday cookie. Push down real hard. Push harder. Here we go. And this is the birthday cake holiday edition. So this is a deliciously smooth cake batter cookie topped with vanilla cream cheese frosting and a dash of red and green sprinkles. It looks very Christmassy, perfect for Christmas week. Ready? All right. Don't mm. like it. Mm. I think it's so good. Hi, thanks. What do you rate it? Five out of zero. It's out of ten. What do you give it out of ten? Mm. Ten out of zero. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm giving it a nine out of ten. It's really good for me. It's got a good cake batter taste. I like the cream cheese frosting. I really like it. I think it's delicious. It's nice, like, it's got a nice consistency, like a nice sugar cookie consistency where it's like a little bit soft in the middle, a little bit crunchy on the end. Hmm. Mm. It's a winner in my book. All right, next, oh, mm. Sorry, I'm trying to pick up the next, oh my gosh, that was good. Oh my gosh. All right, I swear I'm trying to pick this cookie up, not just lick the frosting off. Look at this one with the marshmallows. So cute. So this is the frozen hot chocolate cookie. I love the mini marshmallows on top. So it says a rich chocolate cookie smothered in hot cocoa flavored mousse and topped with fluffy mini marshmallows. All right, so I can tell you, based just on briefly like licking some of it, trying to get the cookie out of the box, it definitely tastes, the mousse on top definitely tastes like hot chocolate. Like it tasted so good. I used to, ah, oh, this is weird, but I used to like, put like a small amount of water mixed with hot cocoa mix and just like eat it with a spoon. It tastes kind of like that. It was really good. <laughs> I used to do that as a kid. It's weird, but it was delicious. So anyway, cheers. Mmm, that's really good. I'm gonna give it a 9.5 out of 10 because that's a really good cookie. I mean, honestly, I'm shocked because back to back weeks, some of my favorite cookies have been chocolate. Like the peppermint cupcakes from last week and this one honestly is even better than that one because it really does taste like hot chocolate and it's delicious and i love the little marshmallows on top very rich flavor i don't know that i could eat like a whole cookie in one sitting because it's so rich but a couple bites at a time pretty good definitely recommend that one for sure all right next up we have another holiday flavor this is eggnog so it says a festive sugar cookie topped with smooth eggnog buttercream frosting and a sprinkle of ground nutmeg. Oh, it definitely smells like eggnog. So I have to say, I'm not like the biggest eggnog drinker, but I do like to get like a little bit at Christmas time and drink like a cup maybe, and like that's enough for me because it's super, super rich flavor, but I always enjoy it. So I was very excited to try this eggnog cookie. So let me know in the comments if you guys like eggnog or if you're like not a fan. I feel like it's a polarizing flavor. So <laughs> I personally am okay with it. All right, cheers. Mmm. It tastes very much like a cup of eggnog. The nutmeg on top is really strong too. Honestly, I taste more nutmeg than like the eggnog. So maybe a little less on the nutmeg next time, but very, very good. I'm gonna give that like 7.5 out of 10. That was pretty good. Not as good as the other two, but still very tasty and I would definitely recommend if you like eggnog flavoring. Next up we have a classic cookie, the Snickerdoodle. Soft yet crispy, a sweet vanilla sugar cookie coated in a sparkly cinnamon, cinnamon sugar crust. It smells good, it smells like a vanilla cookie. What do you think? All right, well, more for me. It's good. It tastes like your average Snickerdoodle. It's not like anything above average, so don't go into it expecting any like 
crazy flavors like some of the other ones but if you really like a basic cookie flavor i think you would like that it, it's good like i liked it but it just it's not wow for me so i'm gonna give that like a i don't want to give it a five that seems too low because like i didn't like it i'm giving it a six out of ten like it was it was good it just wasn't like crazy all right and last but not least we have the red velvet white chip so this one is your favorite cake elevated a dark red velvet cookie loaded with gooey white chip i also have to say i just noticed that this week again they didn't have any nut or peanut flavors which like we love to see thank you very much crumple not that you did it for me or anything but if you did thank you <laughs> Mmm, it smells like red velvet cake. I love red velvet. It's one of my favorite cake flavors, but I don't order it that often. But whenever I have it, like, I really like it. I will say I usually like red velvet with the cream cheese frosting. And I think Crumble has a has a red velvet cookie that has the cream cheese frosting. I think I want to say it's like red velvet cupcake. This one is just red velvet white chip. So I'm curious to see how I like this one. Cheers. It was okay. I think it could have used some frosting. <laughs> I think I'm comparing it to the red velvet cupcake one with the cream cheese frosting that was like so good. This one is not as good. <laughs> it was, I'm gonna put this at the same level as the speaker doodle, like it was good, but it didn't wow me like the other flavors today did. So I'm gonna give it a six out of 10. It was just okay. If you ever get a chance to try the red velvet cupcake with the frosting on top, that one is so freaking good, highly recommend. All right guys, that's it for this week's Crumble Cookie Review video. I think my favorite for this week was definitely the frozen hot chocolate. That flavor was absolutely delicious. The holiday, the birthday cake holiday cookie was good. So was the eggnog. The other two were okay, but uh, skippable if you only want to get a couple cookies. But highly recommend that frozen hot chocolate. It was delicious. Make sure to let me know in the comments which flavor you tried this week and which one was your favorite. Jack, which one was your favorite? Even though you only tried one. Revenina. That was okay. <laughs> that you gave us zero, a ten out of zero. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you for being here with me, buddy. I appreciate it. Should we tell him to subscribe? If you like this video, subscribe. Subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye.